In part one of our series on the troubled teen industry, a Buchanan woman shared her story about the abuse she suffered at the academy at Ivy Ridge in Greenbrier County. Now, reporter Shayla Klein shares tips on how parents can help their struggling teens. The troubled teen industry is estimated to be worth upwards of a billion dollars, and these facilities have been known to spare no expense in using manipulative marketing tactics to lure parents into the programs. Not just my program, but a lot of the other programs. They show photos of kids riding horses and kids going on picnics and day trips, when in reality, that's, that's not the case. They may have taken a group of two kids who proved to be loyal who may be graduating in the next month, took him to a stable for an hour and then snapped a few photos and said, this is equine therapy. Once parents reach out to the programs, Hedrick says they typically use scare tactics to push parents who are already worried about their children to get them enrolled. The person on the other line is, is really taking advantage of them and saying, you know, if you don't send your kid away, they're going to end up in jail. They're going to end up dead. Um, and they really use that kind of scare tactic and be like, don't worry, we'll take care of it. The first tip for parents is to stay calm and skeptical so they can better recognize red flags. A major red flag is if they make parents sign a contract that restricts or removes their rights. Some facilities will also restrict contact between a parent and child. Monitored phone calls and mail make it difficult for a child to report abuse. Some facilities don't let parents drop in to see their child whenever they want and require scheduled visits too. If you were able to reach a level where you then could in turn have a phone conversation with your parents. The phone calls were monitored with the family representative sitting right next to the student with their hand over the phone and they would ready, be ready to hang up at any moment and then tell the parent they're manipulating. They're manipulating you. They're going back into old ways. They're just trying to manipulate you to go home. For more tips and to view the full story, click on the only on WBOY.com tab on our website. For WBOY, I'm Shayla Klein in Buchanan.